Blue Goldsmith made eliminations, lined up behind the gate in the fourth race. Superfecta top five make the final. They're heading toward the start. And they're off. Good beginning for Hail Mary Hanover from the outside. Sophia, let's go. A handful. Luke trying to keep her together. Glide Path scoots out quickly to the rail, and it's Glide Path who leads him onto the opening turret. Sophia, let's go, has settled down a bit. She's moving up in second. Racing in third is Marla Barr, who is bearing out entering the turret. Hail Mary Hanover looks for a tuck in fourth. Mercy Hall on her inside is fifth. Keystone Vogue moving up. She's now parked out in the fifth position. Racing in seventh is Nordique Dish. Eighth on the outside is the field hits the back stretch is Lady Bar. First quarter up in 28 and 3. Judy's Yankee is gapped in ninth at the back of the pack as Raging Lucy who trails the field and Keystone Vogue is in full stride and charging hard on the outside and Keystone Vogue has now easily cleared the top. Sophia lets go, lets her go in second. Glide Path is right there in third. Marla Bar is with the first flight in fourth and it's Hail Mary Hanover on the inside fifth. Lady Bar is closing first up for Campbell on the outside and Judy's Yankee he is drafting off that cover. She's seventh second over as they reach the half in 59 and two. Third over is Raging Lucy into eighth. Mercy Hall has been kicked back and up on the outside in the cover flow is Nordique Dish as Keystone Vogue leads the field on the far turn. Sophia Let's Go is racing in second and Lady Bar continuing that uncovered grind up on the outside and she's now just a length and a half from Keystone Vogue as they trot to the three quarter marker. Judy's Yankee is gapping her cover and Glide Path is trapped with trot but has nowhere to go boxed in on the inside three quarters in 130 and one and it's keystone vogue as the field comes to the top of the stretch and keystone vogue is a length clear right now sophia let's go still drafting along behind her glide path trapped in at the rail third judy's yankee with some crisp late trot and sophia let's go now tips out and here she comes on the outside sophia let's go vaults pass to take the lead keystone vogue could not hold her off sophia let's go has won it Keystone Vogue second, Judy's Yankee third, Glide Path fourth, and Lady Bar fifth, and one fifty-eight and three. Results for the fourth race have now been posted official. Returning to the winner's circle, number six, Sophia Let's Go. Two-year-old filly by Donna Rail out of the Super Bowl mare, Victory Lass. She's owned by Bill Mulligan from New Hope, Pennsylvania. The trainer is Bill Popfinger, and Luke Ouellette is in the sulky. Sophia Let's Go, who barely missed in the matron final at Dover, wins this Goldsmith made elimination. The time 158 and 3, her third victory this season. In the winner's circle, the Meadowlands would like to welcome Anthony Fusco, celebrating his 80th birthday tonight. He's joined by Jean Marie Fusco, Karen Buchanan, and Peggy Buchanan, also trackside. So happy 80th birthday to Anthony Fusco, making the trophy presentation to Sophia Let's Go and winning driver Luke Wallet. Number six, Sophia Let's Go returns 560, 320, 260. Finishing second, number nine, Keystone Vogue, 340, three even. And third, number three, Judy's Yankee, paying 420. Exact accommodation, six and nine, 1860. Trifecta, 693, pays 10360. The one dollar super six nine three five one hundred sixty two dollars and ten cents. The pick three nine six six pays twenty seven sixty. And number six, Sophia Let's Go, a Ken Warkenton Verizon Connection selection. In the upcoming fifth race, the Valley.